taking the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. It's Crypto Lightsaber back with another video, guys. So, we're going to do a quick update on Pulse Drip. Um, I also want to talk about P die or DAI stablecoin or not a stablecoin on Pulse Chain. This is the Pulse Chain copy of uh, DAI, uh, uh, you know, DAI stablecoin, right? And uh, so we will talk about that, okay? But uh, first of all, uh, Pulse Drip price is still looking very good, okay, guys? Haven't done a video in a couple of days been taking a break from youtube okay guys but the game doesn't stop okay the market doesn't sleep for anybody so 15 dollars post drip still sitting at 15 dollars which is very bullish in my opinion the faucet count is growing okay 723 faucets as you can see i have if this is going to load up i need to connect my wallet i have uh two faucets okay one of which i bought on the um uh, the pulse markets uh, as an nft because remember the faucets are nfts and one of which i began with okay guys so we've been doing a bit of claiming a bit of compounding um, i've got a little bit here that i could claim or compound right now uh, my daily roi at the moment still just under 170 dollars um and uh, the total locked as you can see right there um i've got about 1115.4 drip p drip tokens total locked okay guys the team i'm not uh you know the greatest i don't have the greatest or the largest team at all okay but um you know there's other people out there that are building teams and uh you know making it happen Moonshot Max, I believe, has the biggest team. Um, so he's the, uh, you know, the 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 real drip team builder. Go check him out, guys. Moonshot Max, um, bullish on Drip Network, banging out a lot of content for the sorry, not Drip Network, the Pulse Drip, um, amongst other things, other projects. So uh, looking pretty good, guys. And yeah, so I wanted to talk about uh, the garden. Uh, and PDI, okay. And PDI is the uh, is the post chain version of DAI stablecoin, okay. Basically, when post chain launched, there were three copies of all of the Ethereum network based tokens. So you have the post chain version of USDC, the post chain version of Ethereum, the post chain version of you know whatever, right? And PDI is one of them, okay. But for some reason, P Dai has caught the attention of the investors, and you know this thing has been pumping. It's gone absolutely nuts from its lows, right? Out of nowhere. I'm not sure why it started or what was the catalyst for it, but um, one thing I can say is that it really shouldn't be ignored at this point, okay? Because uh, one thing you have to understand is community and sentiment, right? Because if people believe. There's a lot of talk about this potentially going to a dollar, okay, or pegging to a dollar, going to one dollar as uh, the die, the original die, D A I stablecoin should be right, a dollar. Um, right now it's sitting at uh, zero point zero zero two cents. Before it pumped, as you can see, this crazy, uh, you know, t what's that? Twenty seven thousand. That's a two hundred and seventy x, okay. Um, the price was all the way down. Five zeros and an eight. It's now at three zeros and a two. Okay, now I did a measurement to see how far this would need to go to get to this one dollar that everybody's talking about. Now, first of all, obviously, if you look at the chart, you can see that every low, every dip is being bought up. And now it looks like it's potentially about to break out and start making new all-time highs which is extremely bullish, okay, or it's a bullish sign for this particular uh, token, right? Um, remember, this is supposed to be a worthless post-chain copy of the stablecoin, right? It's not meant to be a dollar, but there's the potential for it to become a dollar. And if everybody believes that it will become a dollar, it could possibly become a dollar. And that's the way I see it, right? 
Uh, and what I'm seeing basically is if it breaks this level at the 002156 or 00217 or whatever, right? We're probably going to see another pump or parabolic pump or FOMO pump out of this particular token. Now, all the way to the $1 mark, I did a measurement, right? It's around about a 350x, okay? So, you know, uh, is that possible? Of course it is. It's crypto, right? It's possible. Now, in fact, it doesn't seem impossible, <laughs> I would say that, right? Because... 350x i mean it's already done a 270x now ideally you want it to be in before that major pump okay but nobody could have anticipated that this would do that all of this is fomo okay all of this right here is fomo and like i said i believe that we're going to see more fomo basically because all of this pullback has been eaten up at this point okay it's either going to do a double top always going to pump now what i can see is that people are holding and it's accumulating okay so it's more than likely uh got is is a higher probability that it's going to break out in my opinion uh, another reason why is that if we go back to the uh pulse drip okay um is the p die garden okay so the p die garden is basically adding a staking utility to the p die because you can basically buy it uh, deposit into the garden and that takes it out of circulation therefore causing a supply shock to the dai to, to this token right so as you can see in the garden right now there are 400 and no 42 million uh p die states in the garden okay and um, that's the amount of p die that's gone into the garden okay but um, as Pulse Drip becomes more popular and people see all these options, when they go and check out these charts and they see this, they're going to think, why is this pumping? They're probably going to buy it. Okay, guys, and many will probably stake a little bit into here. Of course, they're not going to put their whole bag in here because once you invest in, in this, it's sunk, right? So the only way to get your investment out is through your your claims. Okay, but you can, of course, you could compound it as well. So ultimately somewhere along the line people are going to be collecting it up and um, you know that means more people are going to be talking about it more people are going to be sharing it um, this is of course bullish for post drip because a portion of the fees and buybacks from all of these gardens right uh, sorry a portion of the fees from all of these gardens go to buybacks okay so that ultimately is a good thing but ultimately p die um, looks like it could potentially go absolutely wild and as people as this grows right people's value in the garden will grow as well which is going to cause people to talk about it and you know it's one of the things that got me looking at it a little bit more as well the fact that uh you know pulse drip or other and, and it's not just it's probably not just going to be pulse drip right there's probably going to be other projects that implement you know these types of utility or or you know um, availability for staking and earning rewards into their projects so you know could there be a lot more supply shop for the pdi token i think it looks pretty good and probably an opportunity that maybe we shouldn't pass up maybe you do want to have some skin in the game on the pdi token um because again you know this is looking pretty bullish and what i'm looking for right is i'm not looking for i'm you know when you see large candles larger than usual on the chart right they're not the candles you want to be buying they're the candles that you want to be kind of taking profit on right but we see this slow gradual climb accumulation and every little tiny little bit of a sell-off gets eaten up it just means that people accumulating and the majority of people are holding the token uh, because they believe that the price is going to a dollar for example okay guys so I just wanted to talk about this because you know you know a lot of people are bullish on it and at the end of the day it's got my attention and uh, you know let's see if we can make some gains on p die and uh, do you hold all the way to a dollar the smart thing is is because this is a highly volatile you know there's no real in my opinion fundamentals to it um in terms of 
you know, there's no team um, that are going to be looking to hold peg or anything like that. Okay, there's no. Um, I don't know how these stable coins work to be honest. Um, the like like the original DAI or whatever, right? But ultimately, this is just basically community sentiment. This is basically they're trying to pump this token because if you the original P die, obviously it's a dollar. It stays a dollar. It goes sideways. Okay, that's how stable coins trade. But this obviously is not a stable coin. Okay, let's just put that out there. So, uh, yeah, that's really all I've got for you in this video. Um, I'll leave the links in the description. Again, Pulse Drip, Bullish Project, guys. This is the the best passive income printer out there right now. So, uh, yeah, don't fade Pulse Drip. Um, and, yeah, I'll leave the links in the description. That's really all I've got for you in this video. Do me a favor, subscribe to the channel. Tick the little bell for notifications. Like the video, which helps with the YouTube algorithm. And I will see you in the next video.